YouTube. I'm back with another video today, man. This one is not an interview. It's nothing like that. You know what I mean? It's kind of like, mirror. Okay. Anyways, so I was just sitting here thinking. I'm like, man, let me do a funny video, man. It's been a minute since I did some funny shit. So I was sitting there thinking, like, what story time can I do? So one popped in my head. So I'm going to do the first time I lost a fight. Yeah. Some people want to admit when they lose. Some people, you know what I mean? This is the first time I ever lost a fight. My family who are going to watch this already know what story this is. And they going to bring it back up and shit. Because I had to deal with this shit for years and years. No cap. Like, all the time. Like, people still bring that shit up to this day. I was in sixth grade, by the way. I am 22 years old now. Sixth grade, how old is you about? You like 12 or something like that in sixth grade. I don't know. Something like that. Somebody help me out in the comments. It's me. I'll watch it. So, look, man. If y'all don't know, I used to be bad as shit in school. Like, when I say bad, like, I probably got suspended a year. Probably, like, at least 15 times I was suspended through the year. Or, and if I wasn't suspended, I was an ISS. Or, I just had to go to the principal's office or something. Or, they call him my mama or something. So, I was just bad. I don't know. I just, that's just how I was. I was just a bad kid in school. So, look, bro. So, this is how you know I was already bad. So, I, I'm I'm in ISS when the fight happens anyway. If if y'all don't know what ISS is, it's in-school suspension. You get in trouble. So, they sit you in this classroom with other bad kids, with one teacher all day. You can't talk. You're not supposed to have your phone. You're not supposed to have... I didn't have a phone back then anyway. But you're not supposed to have none of that shit. So, you're just sitting there all day trying to catch up. You could catch up on work. You could... I don't know. If it's a girl in there, you could flirt. I don't fucking know. But... So you in there all day, right? So I'm in the I'm in the ISS room, you know. I, and back then I was a big head. I don't know why. I was ugly as shit back then too. I used to get this bump on my nose every month. The same bump, the same spot. That's when I knew I was gonna have a little bit of acne, but that's besides the point. So um uh, I was in ISS. It was I'm not gonna lie. My girl gonna see this, but whatever. It was some fine ass girls in there. Like one of the finest girls that was at, in the school at the time was like in ISS. So I'm like, how the fuck you in trouble anyway? But that's besides the point. It's like three girls in there. You know what I'm saying? So that's boosting my head more. And me and this, this is not helping me at all. Cause the dude is white. The dude, the dude is white that I fought. Um, so we in there all day, man, chilling and shit. You know, I had got in trouble the teacher the teacher was like um I, I forgot what happened i think i was flipping tweeties at people or something and i had to go to the hallway if y'all don't know what tweeties is you get a rubber band you fold some paper up and you flick that motherfucker as hard as you can at a nigga anyway it's like the before you start shooting guns that's what it is and i don't shoot guns i don't condone any violence i don't you know yeah anyways um so i'm sitting there outside in the hallway or whatever Hold on, wait. Yeah, I'm sitting out there in the hallway, and then the white dude talked a little bit of shit when we was at lunch. We went down to the cafeteria, and like we was we was cool at the beginning of the day. So I don't even know how we end up fighting or whatever. So we get back up. We got a little tension. It's just a little tension in the room for some reason. So my my dumbass, my cocky ass was like, got up in front of all the females, like asked them to their face. I was like, y'all want to see a fight in here? Swear to God, I was the instigator. I was the one that started the fight. I was everything. Like, everything happened because of me. So, I'm like, y'all want to see a fight? So, you know, everybody in middle school, they're like, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see a fight. So, I go out uh, because a white dude was in the hallway, too. So, we both in the hallway. And I'm in his face and shit. And then, uh, the dude, like, we, we didn't start fighting for a little bit. And then, uh, I, we went back to sit down. And then, I went back over there, right? And we both stand in each other's face. I'm probably like, I'm 6'4 now. Back then, I was probably like 5'6", five, 5'7", five, 5'8", five, I don't know, something like that. So, I'm uh, we stand in each other's face, right? So, he pushed me, boom. I go back, boom. I come back, and I socked him in his chest. I should have socked him in his face. I should have, but you feel me? I ain't, Before that, I ain't never really been in a fight like that. So, other than fighting my cousins and shit like that, but that ain't... You know what I mean? So I just socked him in his chest. Boom. And then we start like tasseling arms, right? Like, type shit. And I'm like, oh shit, I'm really, in my head, I'm like, oh shit, I'm really in a fight right now. Adrenaline rushing and shit. So we pushing each other, 
boom. And I fall over this bookshelf. Like it's a bookshelf he pushed me into and I fell. And the bookshelf fell too and shit. So when I fall, I can't get back up. He already back on my ass. Like he on my ass. I'm like, damn, I'm finna lose this bitch. So I'm on the ground and he socking me like five times. Like, and socked me in my shit. And then uh, the teacher or security guard or something came and got him off me and I'm getting up off the ground. I'm like, damn, I just lost. Like, that's all I'm thinking in my head the whole time. I'm like, damn, I started the fight and lost. But technically, I mean, yeah, I lost, but like, I don't know. If we had a rematch today, I'd beat the shit out of dude. I don't even know his name no more. But so tell me why I got a cousin named Jeremy, RP my cousin. But um, we was both always in trouble anyway, always. And he too, he was two years older than me. Uh, but we was always in trouble. So I was in sixth grade. He was in eighth grade. And uh, tell me why I'm getting in, getting in a fight, I go downstairs and to the principal's office. This nigga down there, this nigga's literally in the office. He like, what happened? I'm like, I got in a fight. He was like, did you win? I was like, yeah. Yeah. You know, had to cap real quick. But everybody was around the school was like, niggas, da, da, da. You, I heard you just lost a fight in ISS and all this shit. And a, another one, RP my nigga to violent, because he was, uh, what happened? When I came back from suspension, this we was in lunch line, right? And I guess he had fought the same white boy that I fought and beat him up. So we in the line, he in seventh grade. And we in the line, he like, you lost to him? I beat the shit out of him. And I'm just like, okay, bro, I'm tired of hearing that. I'm just trying to get my chicken nuggets and my, my mashed potatoes. But, you know, that's the story of my first, um, my first official fight at school. Um, I did take an L. And for all you niggas that be capping act like you ain't never took an L, you're lying. You're lying. See, but now, I don't, it's not with me. Let me tell y'all this before I cut this video off. It's not about, like, just don't be scared to fight. I don't care if you lose, win. You not being scared to fight show me more confidence and respect in you to anything, for real, for real. Because if you get scared and run, or, you know what I mean, go to, you know, if you just fight, win or lose, I'm not going to let nobody kill you if you with me. So it don't really matter. But I hope y'all enjoyed this story time. And if y'all want another one, I'll do another one to something else. Just let me know in the comments.